you're a piece. I am unleashing the beast. Don't move. you are deceased. Now that my powers increased. Don't move. I can't be beat. Bodies then lay at my feet. Don't move. Chuck a release. Better you want to retreat. I'll keep this close. I'll keep this close. Yeah. <gasps> 
This is bad. Such a hassle. <sighs> what am I going to do? Oh, thank the Thousand Winds. Your arrival must be the grace of the gods. If I may ask, 
Envoy sent by the Animo God to save this mere mortal. Could you spare a moment? Ew, cut it out. I cannot let my peers hear about this. I cannot seek help from anyone else but you. Please, let us move to somewhere more fit for such conversations. Let's talk in the courtyard just outside headquarters. Come with me. What's with the sneakiness? This place will do. Tell us what it's about already! How should I begin? Oh, right. Let me tell you a secret first. It's a secret of my past, and I confide in you to keep it. Don't worry, Paimon's lips are sealed. As a matter of fact, my grandfather was a pirate. Oh. Wait, why do you sound so blithe? Do you think I'm making it up? Look at my eye patch. I inherited it from my grandfather, and this is solid proof that we are related by blood. My, how could you not know such common knowledge? <laughs> this is no different from children inheriting their hairstyles from their parents. Yesterday, I was glancing through the notes my grandfather left and stumbled upon records that spoke of a treasure. Treasure? According to his notes, the treasure is buried in the lost Arcadian ruins. Treasure. But the location of the ruins is currently unknown. I've tried searching for clues. Treasure! Kaya, what kind of treasure is it? Gold? Or better yet, gems? <laughs> treasures that consist of nothing but gold and gems are third-rate treasures. My grandfather's treasure is a sword. A magic sword that grants the wielder unrivaled power. Oh, wow! The sword was dropped from Celestia into the sea by a god. It was later salvaged by my grandfather's crew by pure coincidence. The moment he gripped the sword, thunder roared, billows howled, and the clear skies were suddenly swallowed by raging winds. With the might of the magic sword, my grandfather went on to defeat a Hydra, a silver-haired banshee, a wicked abyss dragon. But the immense power of the sword enticed many more greedy pirates. To avoid meaningless conflicts, my grandfather hid the magic sword. These incredibly thrilling adventures are romances that could only be told by pirates. Holy moly, that's just insane! A gang of treasure hoarders has been very active lately, and many ruins have had their relics stolen by them. I'm afraid that they will soon discover the Arcadian ruins, and the magic sword will be lost. We won't let it fall into the wrong hands! We must get the sword before them! You just rest assured that we are here to help! Wow. Great. Please keep it a secret. I'll wait for your good news. Hey! So what you think? Isn't it exciting? We're talking about a super duper powerful sword! Well, let's go to the Adventurers Guild and see if we can find out more! The adventurers should know more about the ruins, right? Hey, kiddo! Welcome to the Adventurer's Guild! Hmm. We're not here for something that boring. We're looking for a sword that fell from Celestia. One that can kill eight-headed banshees and silver-haired hydras. It's super mega uber powerful. It's fine as long as Paimon doesn't tell them the treasure's location. 
Cyrus, do you know where the lost Arcadian ru Arcadian ruins? Never heard of them. Thanks for your intel anyway. If you do find these ruins, I'd love to see them. Uh, my intel? Still no clues. Well, it's not like it's gonna be easy. Come on, it's the hiding place of the super amazing sword. Anyway, we should go meet up with Gaia first. You're back. Do you have news for me? Listen, we asked around the Adventures Guild and found... Well... Nothing. <laughs> <laughs> that much is expected. Why is that? Oh, I only mean that... What's the fun in finding it without the hard work? However, I do have some clues. I sent someone to collate black market intel. It seems that someone does know about the Arcadian ruins. Really? Where's the guy? Now, now, as per the Black Market's rules, they will send someone to meet us to prevent leaks. We will be meeting the informant at the Whispering Woods. Then what are we waiting here for? That's right. You read my mind. I am a knight, so I shouldn't have any dealings with the Black Market. You have my thanks. Of course, you'll be compensated for your troubles. By the knights. No problemo!
Why is this happening to me? I shouldn't have helped him. Him who? Thanks so much for saving me. You're far more reliable than those Favonius guys. It's nothing. She's a traveler. She has to deal with stuff like this all the time. Traveler? I've heard stories about you. I didn't think I'd be saved by the one I'm here to meet. Oh, so you're the... <laughs> I didn't know how I could pay you back initially, but now I think I'll just give you the intel for free. People in our circle know how important the network is. Lucky? But it's lucky for Kaya, isn't it? He's supposed to pay for the intel. Listen well then. The intel on the Arcadian ruins. Three six-armed giants reside in the city in the lake. Two guard the statue, one the treasure. Right. L wait, is that it? There's also this map that came with it. Could this be the X marks the spot? So the clue is more like a riddle. Well, should be a piece of cake for you, right? I'm gonna lead you to it then. Well, if you can't solve it, we can ask Kaya. He seems like a nerd, too. I'll leave you the intel so you can review it at any time. Thanks, Vile. Three six-armed giants reside in the city in the lake. Two guard the statue, one the treasure. What does that mean? If you don't want to ask Kaya, you better figure it out.
Let the wind lead. May the God of Anima protect you.
doesn't love him at all. The passion rushing through the clear spring is just a front. When she's cold and alone, her true heart is revealed. There's another map! More riddles? Paimon's dizzy already! Oh no! Paimon used up all her brain juice! Paimon will let you have all the fun! Or you could get Kaya to help!
Closer. You've been a naughty boy. Yep. Hip. Don't push your luck.
No pain, no gain. <laughs> Weather for sipping a cup of tea while gazing out the window. She doesn't love him at all. The passion rushing through the clear spring is just a front. When she's cold and alone, her true heart is revealed. Any idea what that means? Is this some page stripped from a love novel that you just happened to find? Oh, so it's not a clue. No wonder someone as clever as Paimon wasn't able to get it. <laughs> I'm just joking. Seriously, Kaya. <laughs> this riddle is hard to figure out. Clear spring. Is it referring to Springvale? Passion rushing through the clear spring. So when does passion rush through a clear spring? 
not a bad idea. Like when there's a waterfall, for example. It appears the solution to this enigma relates to the waterfall behind Springvale. Only the clear spring that blesses Mondstadt can reveal the passion described here. And the heart of the waterfall must refer to the cliff on the left side of the waterfall. I noticed it once when I was out on patrol in the area. The ending, cold and alone, probably has something to do with cryo, which can be controlled by a vision. You should probably take someone who can manipulate cryo with you. It's nothing. If a knight of Favonius couldn't even answer a riddle, how could we be trusted to solve criminal mysteries? Let's go take a look in Springvale. We'll leave you to your criminal mysteries. Um... Uh, no, wait! Um, leave you to solving your criminal mysteries. <laughs>